So what are you doing? What's in the news? Uh, well, if we're excited about the Hobbit Marathon, which I kind oh. of am. I kind of am, but at the same time, I'm not. Because this marathon, it's, it's going to start at 1230 in the afternoon. And each movie is like seven hours long. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so that means the last one, they said the last one's going to be playing around, they're going to try to push it toward nine o'clock. Meaning from 1230... And the last one, the third one, the Battle of Five Armies, is going going to be two and a half hours long. So if it's going to be nine o'clock, that means eleven uh, thirty. So twelve yeah. thirty in the afternoon to eleven thirty. That is it's, horrible. It's almost twelve hours. I just don't even like the movies, to tell you the truth. <laughs> I don't understand the movie because, like, in the first uh, Lords of the Jewelry or what mm-hmm. is it, Lord of the uh, the Rings? Yeah. <laughs> The ring thing. <laughs> <laughs> That's the same kind of movie, right? Yeah, yeah. Same it's, thing. This uh, takes place the, before. Yeah. Oh, it does. Yeah. Oh, how exciting. <laughs> Leading up to a movie I didn't like. Um, but in the first uh, Lords of the Rings there, mm-hmm. they they could have just flown on those chickens or yeah. uh, whatever they are. The eagles. Well, the eagles. Uh, the, uh, hawks, whatever they the are. All the way thing, there. Like it, It's about the journey. It, the whole thing about it was there was a, a disagreement between them and that they weren't going to help anything. They were neutral. They're not going to help the good, the bad. They're not going to do But anything. they do. At the end, Gandalf, you don't see Gandalf actually asking them. For and their Gandalf's help. The, the wizardy yeah. guy. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And they, that finally, they're like, fine, whatever. You know, basically, uh-huh. and that's what happened at the end. So that's why they weren't at the beginning, because so, they were neutral. So basically, the Hawks were jerks, mm. like the whole thing, and they could yeah. have helped. Yeah. They could have been like, yeah, hey, we'll drop your jewelry into the Eagles. oven thing, whatever they are. <laughs> the Eagles. The Eagles. That's a football team. Yeah, the Redskins, yeah. Redskin eagles. No, okay. you are so racist. I am. I They're hawks. Be. You don't oh, call them eagles. Oh, right. They hate it. When you oh call, gosh, that's so terrible. Call, uh, no, the 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 hawks or whatever they are could have just carried the jewelry there. I don't mm. understand the Hobbit movies at all. And I think he started that whole principle. What's the guy's name that did it? Um, uh, um, the uh, uh, George R. R. Martin. No, I'm kidding. No, <laughs> J.R. Tolkien. No, no, the guy oh. that's doing the movies, uh, Jackson. Peter Jackson. Peter yeah. Jackson. Mm-hmm. Like, he started that whole stupid tradition of uh, dividing movies up, I think. Um, well, when Lord like of the Rings came the out, the Mocking was, Jay thing. Yeah, that's that was dumb. And the same thing with the Hobbit movies. They could have done one movie or even two. And they're adding a bunch of side stories and a bunch of, like. More characters for the happened. toys. Yeah. yeah, even the seventh doctor's in there. Um, McCoy, he's the seventh doctor, and he's playing. McCoy from Star Trek? No, no, no. Star Wars. No, I always get yes, them confused. Yeah, yeah, no, both of them. He's in both. Really? Um, and Damn it, I'm not a <laughs> hobbit. <laughs> I'm a he's, doctor. He's, uh, yeah, yeah. He's, well, he's the seventh doctor, and he plays Radagast. He's the, the brown wizard. He plays. <laughs> It's okay. Do you, do you even listen to yourself? <laughs> he's Mexican. The brown, right? he's a Mexican wizard. Adam, he's just very filthy. <laughs> what? Um, he doesn't like well. The brown wizard <laughs> is, I have gas. <laughs> and what was his name again? Uh, Radagast. <laughs> Radagast. <laughs> and he's not anywhere in the Hobbit movie at all, so... Uh-huh. Having him in the movies is to get the people that watch the uh, yeah, and they're having Doctor Who is having, it or whatever. Well, maybe I don't know. <laughs> That's it's the, the only reason he doesn't exist in the story. They're just stretching out the movies, and mm-hmm. they, like I said, they could have had the Hobbit movie put one or two, but they made it into three. That's why the second movie is my least favorite because uh-huh. they just added way too much. The salation of smog. <laughs> A lot of people say smog, and I was like, no, it's smog. How ridiculous. How, I know. It's, how ridiculous no, would it sound if they said smog no. <laughs> instead of smog? No, it's, it's not polluted. I mean, uh, well, he's a dragon. Well, that's like the Mockingjay. I went and saw the Mockingjay movie, and that, uh, the f- wait, wait, let me get it right. It's the third movie, but the first part, so like, yes, first part of the third movie, mm-hmm. which is really the first well, prelude the, to the fourth movie, but like there's really is a trilogy. The first half of the third book. Yeah, I read yeah. the book. I read the book. Uh, it took me like two hours, and um, but it was really irritating because you you didn't see it, did you? Did you see no, it? No, I okay. I'm actually not a fan of those. I I read the book. The first one. So brown wizards and the hawks and stuff are okay. I'm all for it. I mean, but yeah. But kids killing as, each other. Yeah, because I already saw it, I saw it in Battle Royale. And I was like, oh, I like Battle Royale because that was awesome. And uh-huh. this one's like a, like a not Battle Royale. Yeah, it's mm. a different movie. Uh, so, <laughs> that's why it doesn't know, have the same the, name. It's the same. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> but the... The whole problem... Did you get it? Well, it's just right. kept people... Are like, you filling to... out your eHarmony? Yeah. Just you spelled statutory wrong. Oh, darn it. Yes. Oh, <laughs> anyway. Uh, edit. 
um, but the first part of the Mockingjay movie was just a set up like a commercial for the second movie that's it like there was no reason for it that book I thought was the simplest of the books really mm. and it becomes oh you read it yeah oh, right. yeah I just said that you were oh you yeah. were, well, you were yeah. filling out your grinder Sorry. and uh what is it the thing I don't even know what it's called there's a swipe left and stuff what is it called I don't know Tinder. That's it. Yeah. How come I know that stuff? Tinder. I don't know. Tinder, oh, not Tinder. Tinder is <laughs> a whole different that's dating a way site. Wrong app. Oh my god. Yeah. That's if you're paying, if you're tendering uh, to swipe yeah, people, goodness, you might want to look into that. That's, that's something word. like the Brown Wizard and <laughs> <laughs> we had gas Tinder, or whatever. Tinder, brown Wizards. Yeah. So, anyways, so movie recommendations. Uh, go and spend eleven uh, hours. Oh my. I don't think I'm going to do it. No. Um, you know, they have those on DVD, right? Yeah. But it's $18 for all three or the last one for $12. So 18 to sit oh, there. And, yeah. Yeah. Or $12 and you see the new one. I, but I, it's not worth the butt sores. It's if, really not. And, and, and you th- can't even sit here without multitasking, <laughs> let alone... <laughs> Oh my gosh! Everyone Having your uh, eye hop and stuff out, and you're going to be doing. Well, that I'm going to bring my iPad to that. Do that. Yeah. Bring like a whole media center. Yeah, full brightness. Mm-hmm. They love that. <laughs> it's their favorite. It's like... And the best thing is, restrooms close that day at the theater, mm. so that'll be fun. Do you imagine? I mean, I mean, I'm not saying that people who are fans of fantasy and stuff don't shower, but. They they don't some of them don't shower no because their moms are usually uh, in there well there and you so go they can't. <laughs> so eleven That's hours my, hence the brown wizard <laughs> eleven hours oh I see the relation it's all coming around oh now oh my gosh full circle full circle full circle wow and That's so why I'll be the eighth doctor <laughs> <laughs> no that was the other guy using the movie oh there is an eighth doctor yeah, I don't know these it's okay. things it's okay. That's the guy that lives in the phone booth. Yeah, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. yeah, he lives in there. <laughs> <Gosh>. <laughs> I, re- I really don't follow this stuff, and I love that it aggravates it's, you. Like it's, it doesn't at all. <laughs> but uh, it, it's, I, I am going to go watch the third movie. I don't think I'm going to watch the first two at all. Oh, I'm debating. Uh, Eleven hours, and it's going to be mm-hmm. stinky, and and they're going to have breaks in between. They said they had uh, last time they did the the Batman marathon, the Dark Knight, mm. and that was it was tolerable but by the third movie which is something brand new i was getting sleepy you know i actually listened to um great segue i actually listened to a podcast with uh, uh adam west oh, talking about awesome. yeah talking about the batman and stuff mm-hmm. and about uh the old jokes that just came out on blu-ray and um i didn't realize they did two episodes a week it was on twice a week wow. every week like he said they got like one or two months off max Jeez. And they did, they would film a full hour and then divide it, make a cliffhanger in the middle. And they, they were on twice a week. So like every Tuesday and Friday or something. That's, and that's insane. That's a little like bit, a little right. bit. But they were talking about the dark night uh-huh. and all that. And he was wondering about his voice, like mm-hmm. why he talked like that. <laughs> <laughs> and we so saw it on TV stuff. the other night. And I <laughs> actually had to turn on the closed caption because I couldn't understand <laughs> what um, Blaine was saying. <laughs> Or uh, whatever. You have to use a cup for your hand. Yeah. I'm going to get your bad mom. And you're like, what? Excuse me? <laughs> and I don't understand. And as he pointed out, when they did it, it was a comedy. And a lot of people took it serious and stuff, but they were shooting it as a comedy. <sighs> and he said, what happened? And he blames Frank Miller and the... Uh, see, I know. I know oh, some wow. Of Look stuff. at that. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I wrote it down. <laughs> um, but blames him for the Dark Knight image. But hmm. I don't have a problem with it because I think Superman... Is uh, annoying, Mr. Goody Goody. Yeah. You know? I'm, I, I don't think I'm going to like the Superman, Batman movie either. Really? Not enough wizards and, and, uh, and, and brown birds. Wizards, and, brown wizards. Yeah. You got to get it right. There's not enough of that. And I have no clue how the plot's going to be. Uh, one of the most iconic moments was whenever Batman actually defeated Superman. He didn't kill him, uh-huh. but he had that awesome speech where he had him, and he's like, he's like, I want you to remember my hands around your throat. Oh, you yeah. know, that, and, and is that how he said? Yeah, that's how he said. Like, it. Well, around your throat. He's bad. Well, he's just he's enforcing bad. the illegal immigrant yeah. policy <laughs> <laughs> because you talk about the uh, the most ultimate illegal <laughs> Im- immigrant. Well, he just says that, that, that I'm I'm the, the man who beat you. Wait, get close and say it. I'm the man who beat you. There you uh-huh. go. Yeah, that's what he says, and. It's just like, oh, snap. And then mm-hmm. it was just one of the cool Batman moments. How, how does yeah. he beat him? 
<laughs> oh, <laughs> obviously beat him. Kryptonite gloves. Yeah. Kryptonite gloves. Mm-hmm. That's all it took. Yeah. <laughs> but it's really hard to get. And I don't know how... I can't remember how he got them. But he had... Uh, did he put it in his blood, too? No, I don't think so. I thought he did. No, they're gloves. I gotta remember again. Yeah. There's yeah, you don't want to get that wrong. There's a lot just of, in case. There's a lot of drinking, man. Well, it's yeah, a hard life. <laughs> I saw... Um, what was the uh, the first... Uh, the bat or the Superman that came out like seven or eight years ago. Oh, you mean the you can take a nap in the movie theater and it was awesome. Yeah, Kevin Spacey was. That yeah, 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 yeah. So I'm at that, and Brad, they get to the scene. Had something with Superman. I can't remember his name. Yeah, and they get to the scene where um, uh, the bad guys uh, shoot Superman or mm-hmm. shooting him like crazy with yeah. the gun, and he walks up and know, shoots him in the eye. Yeah, and, does the whole and I was there with someone, <laughs> <laughs> and at that point, she's eating popcorn. and She turns to me and goes. Yeah, right. <laughs> and I said, so Whoa, everything, <laughs> everything is up okay. to this point Dang. is fine. No. But him having a bullet bounce off his eye, that, that was it. Him. The that... flying, the tights, Why the did whole... He should have blinked. I would have believed mm-hmm. that. If he blinked. No. The non-life support system in the capsule that brought him to the planet. Like, all of that <laughs> stuff was okay. Yeah. But the bullet, <sighs> too much. It was, so. I... I think it'll be fun. I it's, I'm, I'm gonna go watch it. I am, but I'm not gonna be excited about it. Um, oh, you'll there's, be excited. There's a lot of other movies to be excited about that year. It's next year, right? Next year, we got um, Captain America uh, three. Oh yeah, there right? we go. Yeah, yeah that's I think so. so. I can't remember. Um, uh-huh. And then December in 2015, we got the new Star Wars. What? Yeah. There's a new Star Wars coming out. Yeah, I think it's the ninth one. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's a little crazy yeah. though. Uh, uh, and uh, what other one did I see? Oh, I saw the new uh, Terminator uh, uh, thing. You mean rehash the rehash yeah, number? Rehash. I think it looks cool. And he said all his catchphrases in the one little teaser. He's Come on, get to the job. It's Terminator, and, he's, and then he's about to fall out of the helicopter, and he's like, "I wonder what he's gonna say." And he's like, yeah. "I'll be back." Yeah, well, he jumps out of the. Yeah, thing. okay. <laughs> Oh, come on. The Terminators were good, except for uh, the third one, the fourth one, and the fifth one. I love the second one. Uh, yeah, I, just, I hope one. this one's good. I really do, but I don't, I don't know. They Next year's going to be like a big... They keep doing full circle, like, oh, we could have prevented it, but we're actually... But this is a cool to... one. This is like the beginning. This is when they send Reese back, yeah. but he gets here and like things are different, and so I, he doesn't know how to help. I, I'm excited for that, but it's going to be like... Imagine if you can travel in time. I'll try. Okay, now yeah. go. You can okay. travel in time. Uh-huh. And you, I'll see you next. You, I'll see you last week. Well, yeah. If you want, you want to kill Hitler, right? Hitler's a bad guy, right? Yeah. So you People, go. I, I heard he was a mean he's, drunk. He's a mean. I hear he's a mean he's drunk. They ter- didn't drink. He was a mean drunk. Yeah. Um. So you want to kill Hitler, and I you do. want to save all the Jews. I want to save them. All. Say you, you just want to, and so you kill Hitler, right? You're mm-hmm. like, ah, there you are, Hitler, and you kill him. But you're actually making Hitler by killing him. You're thinking yes. you're killing him, but it's somebody else that takes his place. Yes. So you were actually There's a the Twilight reason, Zone of that. Yes. Uh, you're the reason that you you made Hitler, and so events had to happen the way they do. So that's how I think this one's gonna go. Like, oh, this is gonna because of what they've done actually puts the events in the yeah place. in the motion. Yeah. yeah. And I don't want to see that. If they surprise me and it's completely different and it's like. Oh my gosh, I didn't expect that at all. Then right, awesome. Right. Just a lot like Interstellar. Interstellar. Oh. <laughs> not with this movie again. You know I love time travel and yeah. stuff. Like I love it. And yeah. Interstellar just ruined it. I I I love the movie up until the, the moment. I don't want to say what it is, but the moment where it's impossible. It's yeah. just impossible. Time line wise and it wrecked it it was unneeded it was unnecessary if they had left it out like when he did uh, Inception Mm -hmm. and left the people wondering it was brilliant it was perfect because people left the theater like what Inception yes and it was awesome and it kept people talking and and, and the forums and internet went crazy if you went on there and you were trying to find something like what's the real answer you saw crazy theories yeah but you know what I saw where he did an interview recently and talked about Mm -hmm. that and they were asking him about it and he said people were missing the point mm-hmm. that the the um, token or mm-hmm. uh, what do they call it? Yeah. Was it token? Yeah, it was a token. Token. The token Black guy. At, the, at that point was irrelevant to uh, to uh, Leonardo mm-hmm. um, 
Da Vinci or whatever his name is. Uh, So uh, (laughs) that was the point, is that he just didn't care anymore. He didn't even look at it. He left and stuff. The point that the audience was supposed Mm -hmm. to be left with is that he was happy and he didn't care anymore. So whether it was real or whether it wasn't, didn't matter to him. But people want answers. They do. Same thing with, Mm -hmm. we keep connecting all these films, like Cloverfield. Um, Did you watch Cloverfield? I really liked it. Mm -hmm. Um, It was a found footage film. You know, people were like, oh, found footage. Oh my gosh. Like, I I don't like... The Paranormal Activity movies. I don't know. Um, but Cloverfield, it was neat. And it started off saying, this is found footage. Da, da, right, da, right. And I loved every bit of it. And at the end, whenever they're in the tunnel and spoiler alert, it's been like five years. Why not him? Why haven't you watched it? And um, they, the, the tunnel's caving in and the tape ends. It just right. stops. Well, that's the end of the tape. And people right, were right. mad. They wanted explanation. They wanted anything. And I was like, no, that's not the point. Yeah. You can't have an explanation. And and there's going to be those kind of people that, that they want an explanation. They don't want to enjoy the movie for what it is. They want everything explained to them. And Interstellar did that wrong. Yeah. They explained yeah. everything. They didn't need to. Like, they could have just left it up in the air as to oh, what man, that, been what that secret and was. Like we said, it could have easily been, like, the internet would have blown up. Mm-hmm. Crazy theories. Mm-hmm. Uh, what? Uh, oh, that would have been so cool. And then, but Christopher Nolan, and, uh, Nolan, he just, he saw too many, I think he's just a big fan of Doctor Who and a yeah, cause of yeah, Doctor yeah. Who fan, and, and I think that's where he incorporated some Yeah, of that. but it still doesn't make sense. It cause doesn't. and effect. Cause mm-hmm. and effect principles were all... He just wanted, he... Cause, yeah, you're right. Cause and effect was not there for him, and he doesn't care. Right. And he made a lot of money. Well, you know, you're saying about endings. Uh, yeah. People need that. In in America, they need that. Because, like, for example, <sighs> I Am Legend has mm. an alternate ending. Have you ever seen it? Yeah. And um, and even in the books, it was brutal. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And th- it was like the fourth version of that movie. I've watched all of them. Oh. Yeah, there's one with Charlton Heston where the... They're trying uh, to remake that. By the way, I yeah. Well, the in the Charlton Heston one, I don't know if you've ever seen it. Mm-hmm. Omega Man. No, it's the same story. Oh, I didn't. Uh, know yeah, he's living in an apartment and you know keeping these people away, but they are. Uh, it's done in the seventies, I think, and they're like um, disco, <laughs> like hey, groovy man, come out and join us. Like they talk to him and stuff. Oh man. Oh yeah, it's that crazy. Like, they ride like motorcycles and stuff. Oh, what does that remind me? I think South Park did an episode. South Park has done everything, but. It's a, oh, no, it reminds me of the, um, oh, what's that band and the group and the ding, 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 New ding, kids ding, in the ding, 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 Oh, man, oh, my gosh. And they're like, everybody's shuffling. In the music oh, yeah, video, yeah, yeah. they're like, what happened, man? They woke up from a coma, and they're like, what happened? Be like, you just got to keep dancing. You got to make sure that you keep dancing. If you don't dance, they're going to know that you're not one of them, and then they're going to make you dance. Right, right. And the whole music video is them like trying to get away by dancing. Like, oh my yeah. gosh, we better make yeah, sure they don't what this is. But that's my point that's is weird. that they <laughs> had to <laughs> they had to video. wrap up and change the ending <laughs> and they said that the end that they had on the internet show was shown everywhere else in the world, but except in the US. Because the test audiences weren't happy. Mm-hmm. Oh, because they need a finale. They need. They don't want to be left oh. guessing and stuff. And there's several movies like that. And stuff. I think uh, in the books, if I can remember correctly, um, they caught the person, Will Smith, and they caught him. Put him on trial and stuff. Uh, well, yeah, didn't right? Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. And then, um, but he was the boogeyman. Yeah, yeah. Him. That's what they explain. Yeah. In that is that the name I am Legend is that he becomes the boogeyman. He's yeah. the legend the that that race tells people. Um, to scare their kids. Mm-hmm. Like, he's the one that they keep. And there's two different levels I of thought. them in the movies and the books where there's this society that has courts and police and everything. Mm-hmm. And then they have the ones that are brought back from the dead. Mm-hmm. And those are the monsters. And those are the enemies of them as well. So, so it was it was a nice twist. It was like a nice Twilight yeah. Zone. Man, they got to bring Twilight Zone back. Yeah, they tried that. Uh, So, anyways, we have uh, go see um, The Hobbit. Yes. uh, Marathon, if you don't have a life. Um, Um, Star Wars coming out. Pillow. Yeah. Uh, Star Wars coming out uh, Um, next year. year. And Terminator. Going to be awesome, despite what you say. And (laughs) what are the other things? They even spelled it wrong. (laughs) What? They even spelled it wrong. What is it called? Terminator. Um, no, Exodus. Terminator, it's going to be great. That's what it's going to be. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's the name of it. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, uh, the Terminator thing, and uh, what else is going on? Oh, they're, ma- um, they're remaking another Bible movie. 
Um, yeah, we know how that ends. There's a book. They should make a book about those. <laughs> That'd be great. Exodus. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Moses one. Yeah, we probably shouldn't talk about that. Oh, okay. Uh, <laughs> so, oh, my God. Yeah, yeah. Uh, so, anyways, a bunch of movies for you to go see. Check those out and uh, have fun. Yay. See you around. Bye-bye.